Alright you guys, welcome to the vlog. Actually, this is the first DIY video, only DIY video. Because today I have something that I've been waiting for from my friend for quite a few, quite a long time now. Um, we're going to try, if I, have the, if I don't have the tools right, we'll get some tools. But we're going to try and install this today. You guys know what it is. It goes on the front grill right about here. Right about there, so we're gonna try and see if we can do this. Um, I apologize in advance, I don't even have my tripod with me. Unfortunately, I forgot that at home. Uh, as you guys can see, I'm wearing my uniform. It is work day today. Uh, am I working Sunday? I don't even know myself. Uh, let's just open up my hood. Oh my god, hold on a second. All right, so today we're, like, like I showed you guys, we're installing my N STI emblem. My car was missing this, obviously. Um, I've been waiting quite a few, quite a while for this to come in by mail. So I'm um, not sure how to put this on. I'm not gonna lie. I have no idea how to put this on. I know I'm gonna put it right over here on this front grill. Um, as you guys can see, it comes with like little tiny screws. Sorry for the big trucks. It comes with tiny screws, so I'm gonna have to unscrew that, and we're gonna see how this actually fits. Um, maybe I'll just take off the front grill like it looks like I have to. Alright, um, it looks like I gotta take off like maybe, uh, two pins. I think, yeah, I'm gonna have to take off like two pins just to take off the grill. Now, I'm not sure if these pins are literally attached to the bumper. Um, honestly, it doesn't really bother me if I fuck it up because... This is a DIY video, so it's to be expected. Um, let's see here. Okay, so I'm not gonna unscrew this because this is, will be a take off the bumper. I don't need that. Looks like I need my screwdriver set. You know, you know the flat head that you could just like pop off stuff like that? Looks like I'm gonna need that. All right, so basically what I'm doing, um, this, little, this little bolt right here and this little bolt right here, I have to take this off. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, this is gonna come off this uh, front grill. But what I just realized is that this is actually attached to this, attached to this. So, listen, if I fuck anything up, I'll just ask my friend Wayne to help me. But I highly doubt I'm gonna screw anything up. Um, I'm gonna take off one clip with my screwdriver. Uh, the one I'm gonna use is actually this one right here. I'll show you guys. There we go. I got the piece out. I'm gonna use this little guy right here because it looks like that I could just maybe pop the shit open. Yeah, you can see. I could just literally pop that shit open. I'm gonna try and do it. If I fuck up, I fuck up. No big deal. That's what that's that's what that's what this car is all about. Fucking it up, learning, fixing it. Alright, quick little update. Um this little bolt is actually harder than I thought taking it off. Um I know you could definitely take it off, these two, because then the then the whole grill, this whole thing here is gonna come off, so. It's not gonna be an easy job, but as a beginner, it's gonna be a little difficult for me, but I don't wanna sound like a complete bitch. Uh, oh boy, I'm missing my bottle cap for my cooling fluid. Nope, that's not, that's the uh, windshield, windshield washer. I apologize, let me correct myself. So, I'm gonna have to try and pop this guy open. Uh, I have a long time before I start work. So uh, that's, we're gonna get it done. Like I said, I can't re record, unfortunately, doing it because I forgot my damn tripod. But um, I would definitely keep you guys updated. Maybe find like a little stand over there, put my phone somewhere there. And uh, yep. Oh, new wipers, by the way, and new windshield. You guys know the vlog. All right, so pretty much what I'm doing right now, I left my uh, phone on the windshield dash, leaning on a wiper. That way I could record while you guys see me trying to pop this guy open I know this little bolt comes off but the problem is she's giving me a rough time coming out now you might think I'm scared by breaking anything believe me I am not scared my if I my, my, my friend my friend Wayne watches all my vlogs so uh, if I mess anything up he knows exactly what to do so I'm not really worried about that plus it's easy to find stuff I just go to like Kenny Upol or something Oh my gosh, she is tough to get out. Alright, so basically the, what I'm doing the whole thing is, as you guys know, 
uh, this bolt right here and this bolt right here, these two, I gotta take them off. They're attached to this, but th it doesn't really matter. Once I get these two bolts off, this whole grill right here is gonna come off. That way I can install the STI emblem. Um, how to put it back? Uh, I'm probably just gonna pop it in and that's it. If not, I have some stuff at my house or I'll just buy some stuff to keep it in. Uh, it's not a really big deal, but uh, I know exactly how to do it. Just that she's, be she's being a little complicated coming out. She's being a little complicated. All right, well, I did find a, um, a small closer up angle for me to record for you guys. It's actually up between my battery and the wires. Not really a good idea, but whatever. I almost got this little uh, bolt out, to be honest. It's like a, it's not a bolt, it's a rubber clip or something like that. I'm not gonna lie, she's actually kind of hard to take out. But I'm, I'm almost getting there. Joseph! Yeah, it's my bot, my uh, night manager. Oh my god, I'll, I'll show you guys what I'm doing here. All right, so basically I got I got this literally almost open. Where am I here? There we go. Literally, I got I have to undo this whole thing. Then the bitch is gonna be the the other one. She's getting, she's giving me a rough time to get out. So I'm gonna have to like figure something out here, boys. Ugh. All right, give me a second. Not sure why this is actually really, 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 really hard to get off. Like, this should be an easy fucking job. Jesus. Either I'm an idiot and I'm not even doing the right bolt, or I'm doing it right, I just have, I just can't get her out. That's another issue. Oh my god, yes. I can't tell if it's, it's not screwed in though, eh? No, it's a, just a bolt. I could literally just pop it back open. Pop it back up. So. Oh my God. I gotta give myself a few minutes. Whew. Damn. Whew, boy. All right, we're gonna cash that one again, boys. All right, quick little update. Um, oh boy, I got a big ass wasp right in front of me. <laughs> quick little update. I get, I'm not. I'm gonna give this bolt a break here. I'm gonna try the other bolt. Uh, maybe one. Maybe there's a certain way to take it off. I don't know. Maybe there's a pattern on how to take off. The, it's only two bolts. Imagine I'm only having problems with two bolts, or I'm just not using the right uh, tool for this. Probably one of the reasons why I'm not. I'm probably not even wearing the right, having the right tools, which is hilarious. Cause I do have money for extra tools, but I gotta save up to pay my credit card. Y'all know what's up with that. Yeah, see this one here pops up easily. All right, um, quick little update before I do anything else. I'm gonna just do a quick research on YouTube, how to um, install STI emblem on the front grill. And uh, hopefully I'm doing it the right way. If I am doing it the right way, then I'm just not using the right tool, but I'll force it out, I'll force it in whatever. But um, yeah. All right, quick little update. Um, I did some research, and uh, apparently I was taking off the wrong ones, but they feel like the right one because I don't I don't need to take off the whole grill just to install one emblem. I just wanted to take off one part of the grill to install the emblem, but uh, I'm using the right tool, so I'm happy to hear that. But the only sketchy part this is my first time doing this. The only sketchy part that I don't like, I gotta take off these, I'll show you guys. All right, so I was trying to remove this bolt right here and this bolt right here, but I did some research on YouTube and it's this bolt right here. You got one, two, you got three, you got four right here, five and six, so Apparently this takes off your front grill, which I I don't see how But I'm just trying to like picture it before I actually do it Um, Because as you guys can see like literally uh, where, where's my camera at? I'm lost <laughs> uh, Focus ah, Focus All right, so as you guys can see right over here this, All right, this little plastic here. You got the bolt. That's literally right here damn trucks you got the bolt that's here 
and one bolt here so you would assume that you could just take off this whole bump this whole uh just this grill part and you can see that it's it, it, you're able to take it out you're able to but i have to take off this whole grill just to install one sti emblem so before i do anything i'm gonna i'm gonna try it and see what i could do and uh hope i don't fuck up all right, um, I spoke to my friend. He couldn't talk much because he was driving. I respect that. I don't like when people text me either when I'm driving. Um, I sent him a clip if I was supposed to take off the two small bolts or all five bolts. I'm not sure. Um, the small bolts, unfortunately, are going to be a real bitch coming off because I am I am using the right tool. That I know. But what I'm sketchy about is that I don't want to have to take off the the whole front bumper just to put an just to put an emblem on, because on I'll be honest with you guys I don't even know how to take off a front bumper which is I should be ashamed by telling you guys this the fact that I'm a car guy so I've got a lot to learn um, I'm gonna have to try and figure out until then um, I hope you guys did enjoy the vlog I uh, hope you guys did enjoy the DIY video I did try. Um, I'll show you my progress actually. Okay, so I don't want to have to remove the front bumper just for a symbol. So a few videos on YouTube told me you gotta take off this bolt, this bolt, this bolt, this bolt, this bolt, and that bolt. So that's five bolts in total I gotta take off. But my friend told me to take off the small ones, the two small ones, which is this small bolt right here and this small bolt right there because these because th these two bolts I'm, I'm assuming are holding this grill place I just need this one out I don't need the whole grill to come out just that side so I'm gonna um, do some more research figure it out if you guys know if I'm the, if you can you if you guys could let me know in the comments below if I'm doing the right bolts is it okay is it the the small these are the small ones these are the big ones okay i'll call them these small ones the big ones so let me know in the comments below do i have to take out the small bolts or the clips rubber clips or the big ones so please let me know in the comments below guys because it's really going to help me out so i can install my baby my baby what else um that's pretty much about it uh other than that the car is ready for the winter um, I'm gonna ride it out just like the way it is for the whole winter and um, You guys know I'm not paying Fido anymore because it's a little too expensive So I'm paying a little bit a little bit so it gives me money it gives me time to save up some money I want to get a brand new performance radiator aluminum from Mishimoto.com my friend has a, like a coupon code. I'll use that um I want to get an air intake from Cobb Tuning.com. They're specialized for Subarus and all of our cars. My friend actually recommended me Cobb, so I'm gonna stick with the Cobb one. The Cobb one's not that even that expensive, anyways. You know, two, two, three hundred dollars. The same thing I have with my Mazda. As you guys saw, my, as you guys saw before, if you guys have been with me since I've had the, my first Mazda car, my first manual transmission car was a Mazda about a year and a half ago. Um, I had a cork sport intake which was really well good so I know now how to install an intake that I'm actually really happy about which is really easy all I gotta do on this car is actually I think remove only one bolt instead of three so that's a plus so let me know in the comments below the small bolts or the big bolts to take off for the grill it's gonna help me a lot and um, Unless I'll just wait for my friend, but I'd rather do it myself so I can actually learn something. Um, during the winter time, I'm letting you guys know that I'm going to be per, or per, placing some orders for my car. Um, I want to get some STI seats f f uh, for the front, both front. Um, a new motor is going to come in, obviously, next summer. Um, new radiator, intake. Um... I have all season tires right now, all four season tires. I'm gonna get rid of those. And I'm gonna go to get, I wanna get like grip tires, performance grip tires, track tires. You guys know the car's gonna get painted and everything, so it's gonna be really good. So let me know in the comments below, is it the small bolts or the big bolts that have to be removed? And am I using the right tool or not? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching this video. 
I gotta get to work now. I got, I got some stuff to pay. I will see you guys very, very soon. Thank you guys for watching. You guys are beautiful and you're awesome. Remember that. Peace.